If you're a builder or property developer doing work to um, houses and you've always wondered whether the 5% VAT rate could apply to some of the work that you're doing, keep listening and watching because we're about to explain a little bit more about how the 5% VAT rate works. Hi, I'm Alan Davis. I'm the VAT partner at Henderson Loggie and I regularly advise clients in the construction sector on VAT. What I tend to find with um, clients in the construction industry is that they know that the 5% VAT rate is available for, for works to um, houses, but they're sometimes either just not sure or um, a wee bit worried that HMRC will come along later on and, and challenge them on it. So, perfectly common um, scenario and one that I work with on a regular basis. So, before we jump into a few examples, it's always worth bearing in mind that your circumstances will be fairly unique to you and that in the circumstances you should always take professional advice based on your facts before you make any um, big decision in terms of VAT. One recent example um, where I've been working with a client, uh, a builder client who was pitching for some work. Um, together we sat down um, and, and confirmed that the 5% um, rate of VAT applied and the client was then able to confidently pitch for the work at 5% and in that case the VAT aspect of the bill was more than £10,000 um, less than it would have been if he'd um, estimated 20% VAT. He won the work, the client was delighted and, and in fact the client was able to spend some of the saving um, on extra works that they did later on in the, in the project. So all in all, sitting down, thinking about VAT before um, pitching for the work really enabled the client to get comfortable um, and ensured that they were actually able to win the work in the end. I've also dealt with um, VAT at 5% from the other side, from the customer's side. Um, and in that scenario, they'd had some work that qualified for 5%, it was some insulation work, um, but the builder had charged 20%. So we had a chat um, and I outlined how he could fix it. So we went back to the builder, the builder is issued him a credit note for the 15% extra VAT that he charged and a check. So that left the client really happy. Luckily, the builder took it quite well. You know, the builder took it as a bit of learning as well. So they, they benefited and, and they make sure that they charge 5% going forward as well. So what does qualify for the 5% VAT rate? Well, if you're converting a single dwelling into multiple dwellings like flats or vice versa from flats into a single dwelling, that qualifies. If you're um, converting a commercial property into a residential property, but not the other way around from residential to commercial, that qualifies. Or if you're um, renovating a building um, that's been um, empty for two years, a dwelling that's been empty for two years, that qualifies as well. And finally, um, measures for energy efficiency also qualify. So that includes things like insulation and PV panels. So that's a summary of how the 5% VAT rate applies in the construction industry. You may be thinking now about some projects you've got on or some in the pipeline. Um, if you've got any questions or comments about that, uh, please do drop them into the comments box below or by all means contact me directly. Thanks very much for listening and watching and we'll see you next time.